Guys, it's some sort of story event. This is like in um like in Sekiro. Oh yeah. When you go when you go back to the main area and like the big siege is happening at the end of the game. Oh yeah. Great That's game. so fucking cool. Great game. God, I fucking love that shit so much. It's so cool. Yeah. I Whoa! Do. That's not good. It's just so cool seeing like the iconic area that like the whole game is set in just be like just be completely with besieged you. with like random enemies and there's like that game like doubles down on the infighting between enemies. What? What? I didn't do it right at all. Oh shit. Uh, what just happened? I don't know. You know what? Fuck you guys. Yeah. Sekiro's one of my favorites. That's probably at this point. I don't know whether I like it more than I like Dark Souls 3. Um, it's my favorite from Soft, yeah. But it, it's probably my favorite from Soft. I think, like. Hmm. Are you trying to make Among Us? I was trying to draw something, yeah. Okay. <laughs> Um, it's just like, it's got, I think the thing that really gets me about Sekiro is like, I like FromSoft's weird bullshit, their weird story ideas and their yeah. weird just way of being, but like, it's so impressive to me how like successfully that game like tell, just tells a little story. Yeah. I'm, I'm so, I was so invested in Sekiro's like story. I was too. Yeah, with, and with, that that, that was shocking. Thing. Like I, I I I cried at the ending of Sekiro, which is not a thing I anticipated a Souls game doing to me. That game is is just tremendous. Great it's game. really good. Good job from Great Soft. Great game. Good job on that game from Soft. Good job on that one. They won game of the year for that one. That one that was actually like an example of the game awards like being okay with its game of the year choice. Like, is is deserved. Yeah. I was like, oh, that game is good. that game is is enormously good. Yeah. 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 I, I, I it's my favorite from Soft, and then it's probably Bloodborne. That's the, then, I haven't played. I, I I wish I could play Bloodborne. They should release Bloodborne on a platform that should, I can play it on. They sure should. That would make and me then, so happy. I'd, oh my god, dude, that would be like I would. I I don't know. I guess I can't be like. Wow, if there's a new FromSoft game to, to play, I would, like, cry. I'd be so happy. Because I still haven't played Elden Ring. Yeah. So. I, fly, oh, I played, I like, to... probably, like, a tenth of Elden Ring. Yeah, there's still a Maybe. lot of Elden Ring to play. Um, so, yeah. But, uh, I, I don't know, I wanted to play Bloodborne for so long. I love... I love that was my first uh, the, soul, the, so, like, the Soulsborne franchise so much. And that's, what, that's more of a... It's it's it plays a lot more like or it's structured more like the Dark Souls games, so Yes. It's not it doesn't have the open world or anything like that. Yeah. Yeah. And it's pretty good, like, structure wise and feeling like like the Dark Souls one moments where like you're like, Oh my god, this connects like that and like, you know, like Yeah. It it's not quite reached the same level as Dark Souls One, but it's pretty good about it. Yeah. Better than yeah, I mean, I, I, better than two and three, I would say. I think two. Yeah, I, I and yeah, three is not really trying to do it, which I guess is fine. Yeah. Three is like I, I feel like at this point I get something out of every FromSoft game I've played. What is this? Like even even Dark Souls two, I have no idea. A museum? I don't know if it's a museum. It looks like some sort of some temple. Sort of temple? I don't know. Okay. But yeah, I like I feel like even Dark Souls 2, which is a game I think is is not good. Yeah. Um I feel like I got something out of it. Right, let's pop in and see that oh. that crazy old man. Oh. <laughs> it's like the part that wears me out the most in every one of these. I feel like that's why we get tired. <laughs> Wait a tick. I've heard tell of that only the rich and famous call that place home. I'm a totally good friend, Sounds positively scintillating. Dear boy, point us there. You're right, Mr. Famous. 
Pardon me for saying so. Mustn't you have a wealth or fame to ride that train? Ah, no. Terribly sorry. Mm -mm. Impossible. Can't do it. The man's reprehensible. Well, drat. Suppose there's nothing for it, eh, old boy? If we must, we must. Let's go. Oh, is that it? Okay. Oh, God. Great, goodbye. You know that was. Are we meant to? Are we meant to think that Frankly is like a wise old man? I think so. Like I've, I've <laughs> he's been completely superseded <laughs> in my brain. I know, it's just like a fucking idiot. Creature. Welcome to the home of, the home of Merlin. 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 Yeah. Merlin, really. Wait. Merlin, no, wait, you I have this. Go talk to him have... behind the. Oh, there we go. You want this up arrow? Here's an up arrow. Is this good? Here's an up arrow. An up arrow? That's fucking nuts. An He's up going... arrow? Up? Up. This is nothing, Mario. Of course! Of course! Oh? What? He's nuts. Oh. Orb. Orb. The Ultra Stone. That is what the star sign meant. You just had that here? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. So the up arrow was just to remind him that he had this? That's pretty funny. <laughs> These games are very silly. Oh, wow, it's red great now. job, Merlin. Great job. Cool. Now we get to see we an even now. cooler god. So we can, can we power up them. Oh, good, we can. Whoa! We got an upgraded Goombella for the I, I was gonna, so. say, I was gonna say it's gotta be Goombella, right? That actually, guys, Rally Wink to up Mario's attack turns by one. That sounds really oh. good because I've gone like all in on just super powered Mario. Yeah. Yeah. I'm thinking Goombella and then Vivian. Yeah. And then whoever. Well, yeah, we'll do Goombella first. For the fans. For the fans. Goombella, see God, but still be gay. But see God, but still be gay. <laughs> We're not trying to convert Goombella. It's, a, it's okay to be gay, Goombella. I like the Goomba face Goombella makes when she's, she's like, like mm. contemplating God. She's like, hmm. Oh, I get Goombella, it. Goombella's an atheist. Yeah, that's true. How much HP do you have now, Goombella? Goombella, how? 30 HP, nice. Goombella, you're as strong as Bobbery. You are? I think you Rally. have the most HP, yeah. Fucking... They're insane, over here strong. sucks ass. I wonder why, you know? <laughs> I wonder Who knows? Why. Uh, okay, we gotta go to Dom Pianta? Is that what you said? Okay, we'll go see Dom Pianta. I still yeah. want to know how to get... Oh, wait, hold on. I remember... There was a boat thing down where that rat hung out. Oh, by the rat! Yeah, remember that? There mm. was that little port. That was a boat I thing. feel like we've seen all sorts of little boat things I think we throughout have, the yeah. world. There's all manner of little boat All panels. kinds of places we can probably explore now. Probably a lot of hey, Ali, sewers. Are you recording, by the way? Uh, yeah, I'm recording. That's cool. So, it's the Wiggy. Hey, Gigi. Hey, Gigi. Well, I got another piece of the Marvelous Compass at Jazzafraz Town this time. Bro, I'm telling you, I turned adventuring into an art form on that little quest. Whew! It was pretty nutty, bro. Wanna hear what happened? It's a pretty long story. Hey, sounds good to me. Which part of my story do you want to hear, bro? Well, like I said, it's a really long story, but here goes. Okay. As soon as we hit Jazzafras Town, we were overcome by the glitz and glamour. Jazzafras. It's a very lively place, bro. Tons of daisies live there, and they're always smiling. While looking for the piece of compass, I met a hip daisy named Hazy. Goombella's already asleep. Yeah. <laughs> there goes Mario. <laughs> Hazy was a producer, and he was looking for actors to go on stage with him. I told him we couldn't, since we were looking for the compass part, you know. 
But Hazy said we could win the Compass part in the upcoming Drama Slam. Oh, that's crazy. He said the so-called Drama Llama plaque might, in fact, be one of the parts. That's crazy. Well, we just had to give it a try, so we rehearsed with the cast and hit the stage. Our musical was called The Mystery of the Fiery Hat of Social Awareness. <laughs> the script was great, but I got really hosed, bro. My role? My part? Was grass. I played grass by the side of the road. Grass, bro. Grass. I just sprawled out on the ground and had to be silent. Everyone but me had lines. I don't care if I was wearing green. Who cast someone based on that? It was awful. In the end, our musical was the talk of the town, and we won the drama slam. I got the compass part I was after, but even that did make me very happy. The huge after party just bummed me out more, so I snuck out the back door. Oh, Luigi. But wow, outside were tons of fans. My fans. Fans of grass. Okay. They swarmed me. Now you're bullshitting us. <laughs> I just couldn't believe it. Imagine cheering for grass. I was ecstatic, bro. After that, I added the piece to the marvelous compass, which compass, which pointed north. It pointed to the rapturous ruins in Grimble Forest. Then the voice again. Oh, my cherished Princess Eclair, how you soothe me! I would be grass for you. I will be. Grass I will find for you. you. I will reach you. I will stand by your side and be your Luigi. Wow. Sorry about that, bro. Um, yeah, anyway. Then I got back on my boat. I came back to Rogueport, and here I am, another leg of my adventure completed. That's crazy. That's great, Luigi. Alright, let's see what really happened. I'm Hazy! I must say, Luigi is a great actor, one of the finest I've seen. After this adventure, we're going on tour to appear on stages everywhere. I'm going to be known as the Red Miracle, and of course, <laughs> Luigi will be grass. Oh, so he was... I can never play grass. <laughs> I don't know, I guess, I guess like, I think the joke... That's, Goombella, you're adorable. Um... The joke I guess, is that, like... I guess the joke is that, like... They're plants, so playing grass is like a valuable thing to them. I guess, yeah. Like playing grass is like a it's the, like, it's socially like cool. is like a, is like a cool and good thing Ooh. to do. It's a little freak zone. Yeah, who the fuck's been? Wait, is this where the rat lives? Oh, I wonder. There's a chest there. There's right a here. chest there. HP drain. Oh. Oh, weird. Eh. eh. I guess with does does each hit with multi bounce count an attack? Uh, I don't know. Cause that could be okay. This feels like something. Yeah, we'll we'll probably, we'll probably be back here later. Yeah. I wonder where that rat is. I guess cause Luigi's here right now. The rat's yeah. not there. I want this damn rat to like validate me for giving him six hundred coins. I don't think that rat's gonna pay off. I man. fucking better. You know how much money I gave that rat. Do you know how much money I gave that rat? <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. Thanks, Luigi. Let's go talk to the Don Pianta. Don. This is what Pianta. this is what we call consistent world building. This is what we call gameplay. <laughs> yeah, it is. You're fucking right. This is what we over here at Game Pending like to call gameplay. <laughs> gameplay is when you play a game. And you and that's, <laughs> and it's that, what, that, what the, the active it. game is called. Oh, can I blow that up? Probably. Mario's just throw his, throwing his bombs around in the middle of this town, blowing up infrastructure. <laughs> no one even cares. It's fine. It's oh, fine nice. to do that. Oh, nice. Those are. I think we need one more, and we can get another upgrade. Oh. I think so. Yeah, I think we're at two. Hey, what's up? We're here to see Don Pianta. Don't worry about us. We're here to see Don Pianta. Don't even worry. We're gonna to talk to wow, the Don. Wow, 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 hey Don, wow. We, we found your daughter. She's living on an island. She's living on an <gasps> oh, oh no, no, he's dead! He's dead! What the fuck? No! Ugh, Francesca. Oh, poor boss. The big man's been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter's Oh no! Out. 
Our underboss Frankie is gone. The boss is in shambles. What's a syndicate to do? That scruffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us left and right. Hey, but enough about us and our stupid problems, huh? What can we do for yous? Well, tickets for the Rizziest train around? For the XS Express? Whoa, you want tickets for that rolling wing ding Oh, okay. ain't nothing we can do about that. Yeah, us giving out tickets? That's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Francesco. I just can't stand seeing the boss act like this. If we just knew where those newlyweds was, we could take the boss to see him. Mario knows. Hey, we know where they are. Hang on, those two friendly folk, Frankie and Francesca, from Keel Hall Key? Who's on the what now? What did you just say? Repeat that. You know where the young Miss Pianta is at? Really? No lie? I swear to you, if you're lying, I will turn you into confetti, so help me. Yeah. Oh yeah. Well, that's where she is. Why don't you bring her back here, huh? Be a pal. We go ourselves. We can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? Yeah, you bring us young Miss Francesca, and we'll do what we can to get your train tickets. We got a deal or what? Take a hike, Bob. See, now that's better. I knew once you understood our predicament you couldn't refuse. Don't screw this up. Okay. Those guys are hot. Back to Key Hall Key. Wow. wow, I love going back and forth. <laughs> I love, I love going. This game really does have a lot of back and forth. Super fucking Mario. I want to go. I, I want. I feel like there were. I wanted to go check, check down here. I feel like, I feel like there were. Oh. I feel like there were cracks and boats and shit, and I want to explore a little bit. That's fine. I'll like, uh, you this? can do whatever you want. Ah! 